Sweet! They added it to the software. At one point in Alias, in order to change views, we had to hotkey the various layouts. The problem with the layouts was that it actually took you outside of the perspective window and you would have to return to the perspective window. Once Autodesk acquired Alias, they introduced the view cube. And that really changed the game because we were able to model completely inside of the perspective view simply by clicking on the different views to get to our orthographic. And just to show you, if you click on this little arrow, perspective with ortho faces is probably, well, certainly my favorite. But there was always some functionality missing with that technique. Previously, we could use hotkeys to switch quickly between the side view, top view, back, whatever view that we wanted. With the view cube, you always had to travel or go to the view cube to select that. And on a very large, say, 30-inch monitor, that was a lot of mouse miles. So I just realized that in 2020, actually implemented in 2019, and somehow I missed it, there's now the ability to preferences, interface, hotkeys, under the special menu, viewing. And now we can hotkey the different, the various views of the view cube. So this is awesome. Seems like such a minor thing, but imagine, you know, I'm, in, I'm working, I hit F5, I go to my top view, and immediately I can tumble back and start working on the model in any view that I would like. Same thing with F6, F7, and so on. So this is just a really nice addition to the view cube that I believe it makes it a lot more useful and fast. And for me, very important to reduce mouse miles. The, in addition to that, if we are in, say, the left view, so let's just center this, I can use the Shift-Alt, which are the tumbling clutch keys in my case, with the arrow keys, and I can arrow to all the views that I would like. So again, quick way of not having to rely on clicking on the view cube, and I can just use my keyboard and hotkeys to navigate. So this is, uh, is going to be really interesting after 10 years or so of not having hotkeys for my views. I'm wondering if I can implement it in my workflow, and hey, maybe this will help your workflow as well. Awesome, peace. Mm -hmm.